Okay, good morning. Assalamualaikum. This video, I want to show you how to use the average function or average if I mean, but we use operator like less than operator than. Okay, normally we use average if if we want to average that value that uh, refer to other value that is the same or in common. For example, if we want to average all my table here, which the batch or uh, the batch is A, so we use normally like this average if. Okay. And the range you want the reference, the BB column, of course, and then the criteria we want to average the A batch and the average range as you can see it returns the average value of a value only not c or b or other things okay this one normal or commonly we use the average if function now i want to i want to explain to you the next level of this function we can use less than operator Okay, for example, we use average if, we use average if, and then the range, the reference, we put the AA column, and the criteria, let's say we want to average the after 5th month, or from June until December. Okay, we input the quotes and greater than sorry greater than and close the quotes and we put the end symbol okay this one very important this operator first the operator inside the quotes two of quotes and after that we put the end symbol okay and the following is the value we want to reference for this example is greater than 5 or the 5th month and the average range we put here okay the amount of dollar close the bracket and enter okay let's Let's check is greater than 5, it, with, which means from 6 to 12, what is the average? The average on auto calculation is 25238 and our result is 25238, same. Okay, now I want to show you the other example. example. Before is greater than, sorry, before is greater than, now we want to use less than. So we put average if. And the reference, the range criteria, and the criteria of course, quotes less than quotes, and let's say we want to average uh, the value before this month, today month. So we we enter, we input the function of month, and the serial number is today, of course today close the bracket close the bracket and the average range here and hit the enter okay this video I make it on uh, on July so supposed to be it, it returns before July month Let's see, 27, 27, 8, 5, 6, and the average on auto calculation is same. Okay, now the next one is, is greater than and equal. Just copy this function to make it faster. And we just put to enter right after the greater than operator. See, it's very good, very nice. 
after five which include the five the calculator the calculation two five two four five one five two four five one five okay now what if we want to find the average with between uh, this one okay just just from month 4 or April until 9th month which means September okay to make you easier I want to put some uh, I want to insert one of the smart art no 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 I mean the line where, where is the line about the shape I want to put the shape let's say we want to average from okay let's say we want to average from fourth month until September okay so the equation must be like this mm, the logic is uh, 9 X and sorry 4 X 9 like this sorry 3 10 because we don't use the we're not using the less than equal or greater than equal so we use average ifs average ifs okay and the average range we put first the average range the data and then the criteria the first criteria we put the range first of course the a a column and the criteria will be put same like before what is less than okay I mean sorry greater than 3 greater than 3 and comma and put another again one more time the AA column for the second criteria and we put less than 10 and close the bracket the result is 22232 two, two, and we block the result is same okay